Hi Leo, welcome back to Omkara Tarot and to your love bite. Let's see Leo, uh, what message wants to show through for you today. And of course these are general collecting, collective readings Leo, will not resonate with all of you. Please keep that in mind, take what works for you and leave the rest. So let's begin. Welcome back all my subscribers. Thank you, thank you for being here again. And uh, Leo, if you're new here, we welcome you as well. Do join us, subscribe to the channel, become part of us. We welcome you in. Oh my God, Leo, four of one, center of my spread today for you with the Empress right next to that. Okay, oh. Okay, Leo. Uh, uh, Knight of Wands, bottom of my deck. So, either somebody was, uh, well, inconsistent or being a player or it seems, yeah, I think so. I think so. <laughs> but they do want to come in quickly now with an apology, it seems. Um, well, somebody sees their person as the Queen of Wands, somebody who is very attractive, very sexy, very beautiful, turning heads wherever they are going and... Uh, they're feeling they're getting some bad karma here. Mm, maybe they behaved or they didn't respect this Queen of Wands. I don't know because I do feel somebody wants to come in with this apology now. They want to come in with this apology. They look back at the past with a lot of sadness, regret, shame. Um, they feel bad that, uh, well, they never made that offer to this Queen of Wands in the past. They do want a four of wands now, it seems, with this uh, queen of wands who they consider their empress. They feel this empress is the one, this empress is the queen above all queens and this is the one I want. This is the one who makes me so happy. This is my sunshine and uh, they want to offer not just an apology but a brand new beginning, a stable brand new beginning. But there is a blockage here. Maybe the queen of uh, this empress, I guess, who is turning away from my entire deck right now, looking the other way, looking at this knight of wands for what they did, I think, is kind of blocked off at the moment. And uh, let's see, I'm not sure. I'm going to clarify these cards, uh, Leo. Let's start with some dialogue message cards and let's see if you guys could say something to each other, what that would be, and then we we'll clarify the rest. So, Leo and that person spirit, if they could say something to each other now, what would that be? Leo and their person. Leo and their person spirit. Thank you. And Leo, if any of you are looking for personal readings, my email is in the description box below. You can reach me there. Leo and their person. Okay. I'm going to take a few more Leo from a third deck. Leo and their person. Okay. Good to go, Leo. Let's start your reading. The first card here says, I want to protect you, steal your smiles, stop your tears and wake up to kiss you every morning. I want to show you that you are the best thing that's ever happened to me. See, now somebody is seeing the value of, uh, I think, the Queen of Wands who they are considering their Empress. Would you just stop holding back? Lay it all on me. I want you to reveal your true self to me. Tell me your hopes, your dreams, your fears and your vulnerabilities and what makes you tick and what you truly desire. My mind is racing and my heart is breaking with the doubts and insecurities your inconsistent behavior has created. I crave peace, inner peace right now. My soul just feels unsettled. So somebody was showing inconsistent behavior. Maybe that's the reason this uh, empress is not interested at the moment. I'm not currently feeling in the right place for a relationship right now. I do see us together in future. I believe that you are my destiny. Your coded cryptic messages and failure to answer questions drives me up the wall. If you're worried that the karmic is going to see, just call me and tell me the effing truth. It's the least I deserve. I'm healing my heart from past hurt. Give me some time. I admire you. I care about you. I trust you. I respect you. And I love you unconditionally. You are my true love. This situation is messy. 
have to juggle a lot of responsibility right now. So this is almost like somebody is refusing now. Okay, so Leo, let's start with the uh, angel blessing card for you. Let's see what my angels have as a blessing, guidance, advice or a message for this reading. For my Leo gang, heaven is watching over you. Well, that's your blessing for today. Heaven is watching over you. Okay, so now let's start your reading. So, Spirit, what's the Queen of Wands? Why is the Queen of Wands here for Leo's reading today? In the upright, looking really beautiful. Okay. This Queen of Wands is kind of, yeah, they didn't get an offer or they may have waited for an offer of commitment. But at the moment, I do see... Is this spirit okay somebody is very discontent with their own life somebody is feeling very discontent with their own life they do want to communicate with this queen of wands to maybe offer commitment now they do want to put in work in this connection they want to now end the conflict or maybe move on towards happiness with this queen of wands because now they are bored, none of their other options are uh, looking as good as this Queen of Wands, I guess. But this Queen of Wands has become very strong now. They're looking very powerful to me, looking very strong to me. And they could be in a very happy space for themselves. Maybe that is uh, the other person's karma because the Wheel of Fortune is in reverse now. Why is the Wheel of Fortune in reverse? Yeah, now, now the other person I think is recognizing that, uh, oh my God, this is my wish come true. This is the person I should have been with or I want to be with. This is the person I want to have equal partnership with, equal give and take with. But because of something which is now not moving in this connection or maybe something has stopped in this connection, whoever this person is, is now very, very stressed out. I think they've realized it a bit too late that, uh, well, I do want this person in my life. There's a lot of overthinking, there's a lot of stress, there's a lot of tension. Maybe they need to come in with an apology and they're wondering how to do that now. So what's the Page of Cups, Spirit? Page of Cups. Page of Cups. Yeah, somebody wants to take action. They're obsessed with this. They're obsessed with this uh, Queen of Wands and they come somewhere feel that this is my equal counterpart. I like this Queen of Wands to the King of Wands, right? So King of Wands says, well, I am obsessed about this Queen of Wands right now. I'm so sexually attracted to them. I want them in my life. And uh, what do I need to do to get unstuck? They're probably thinking of bringing in an apology or something. Why? Because this person is now sitting in sadness and regret, looking at the past, feeling that they had a missed opportunity maybe. There's guilt, there's shame, there's remorse. Why is that? Spirit, five of cups. Yeah, because now they're recognizing that, my God, this is the person who's perfect. Queen of Pentacles is like the perfect, perfect spouse you could ever have. Uh, loving, caring, giving, looks good, takes care of themselves, takes care of others. And uh, now somebody is really regretting the fact that they had this Queen of Wands and they, well, maybe were sitting in some greedy energy or breadcrumbing this Queen of Wands or something they did which, uh, well, Four of Wands now, Spirit. Why is that the central card of my reading today, Four of Wands? Yeah, somebody wants to work on this connection now. Somebody is ready to fight for this connection now because they are feeling a bit left out in the cold. They are feeling abandoned, they are left behind. So this person could have been a little egoistic maybe in the past. They could have always felt it's my way or the highway or, you know, just I'm the boss or something like that. But all this behavior, I think, has... Uh, this is karma, right? Uh, because of their bad behavior, I think this Queen of Wands has probably now stopped looking at them. Or uh, Now, whoever this King of Wands is, is now needing to apologize for their bad behavior. They do want to work on things. They do want uh, a happily ever after. Because now they're looking. Leo, this is your card and it's come out twice. The Sun card, right? So now they want this happiness with this Empress. 
empress seems to be kind of looking away. Let's see what this empress wants to say to us. I'm going to give this empress the mic now, Leo. So, empress, you have the mic. What would you like to say to this reading today? Empress has the mic, Leo. <laughs> okay, so empress says, you know, Omkara Taro, according to me, it's over. They betrayed my trust. They hurt me. They left me when I needed them the most. This is like a finito uh, situation for me. Uh, they left me holding all the burden. I was the only one carrying all the burden in this connection while they were, you know, having a jolly good time wherever. I got exhausted. I got tired. This is what they did to me. This is how they left me. So that's the reason I've turned my back towards them. I'm looking away. Anything else, Empress? One more card. Any Anything else for you? Yeah. So, Empress says, well, they can come with their proposal. They can come for whatever long-term or stable beginning they want with me. I'm not really interested in having this new beginning at the, at the, at this time. I'm not interested in a proposal from them at the moment. Fool in reverse. I refuse to take a risk with a person who didn't do right by me. So, sun card now here, spirit. What's the sun card? Again. Okay, now, well, somebody is going to have a tower. Somebody's somebody wants to come in now quick and fast. They are going to try everything. They, they may just kind of surprise this empress, I don't know, uh, looking for a reconciliation, um, still wanting that happiness, this person will woo this empress from at least that's what they are holding on very tight to this feeling that I am going to do anything to get this empress back. They, well, they I think want to come in quick and fast to get what they want because they do want this new beginning. Am I right, spirit? So, Ace of Pentacles, Ace of Pentacles, yes, this person is in love finally. <laughs> now, this is the King of Cups. Now, whatever hidden emotions they had are now in the forefront. The more this Empress is kind of shocking them with the fact that maybe this Empress is holding back or they don't want them, they are now saying, I don't care, Om Kumkara Taro, please, this King of Cups is saying that, I don't care, I am ready to come in and start from scratch, from scratch, because I know that I love them. I love them, this is my Two of Cups, this is the one I am meant to be with. But then after that, there is a Two of Swords, Spirit, what's the Two of Swords then? Two of Wands, Two of Swords, Ace of Cups, Three of Wands. Okay. Okay. So, well, I don't think the other person, I think this is the Empress, is going to be deciding. They're blocked off. They're not going to be making a decision. I think this empress has uh, already turned their back or is maybe looking out already for new love. They feel that this is the way to bring justice to my own life because of the way I've been treated maybe in the past. It's going to leave the other person, I think, uh, back into their stress and hermit mode. Am I right, spirit? Yeah, because they want the Ten of Cups now. They are coming forward. They do want to come forward. Oh my God, again. Again, all the same three cards. They, they want to offer this. They thought they could just come in, offer, you know, a pentacle and say, Hey, this is what I want with you. Why is this Empress blocking then, Spirit? Why is this empress blocking? Because uh, maybe in the past they create, there was too much conflict. Yeah, this uh, Queen of Cups has kind of put a lid on that cup of their love now to say, I'm going to guard myself. 
I wanted this ten of pentacles with you in the past, but all that competition, fighting, or whatever conflict happened between the two of you, I've kind of covered my heart now, and I'm guarding myself. I did want this. I did. I did think that this was possible, but well, I think I overgave. So now I'm going to protect myself. So why was the Knight of Wands spirit? Uh, overall energy for Leo's reading today. What's this Knight of Wands? Yeah, see, they, 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 this person who's now showing up as the King of Cups, they could have been the Knight of uh, Wands earlier. They could have been a player or treated this uh, Empress like just another option in their life or not given commitment when this Empress was actually ready. So now when this, I think, person comes back, this empress may not, may block them or not be ready to make a decision straight away. Okay, very like the Aries reading, uh, maybe some of you are dealing with an Aries Leo combination, I don't know, but very similar to that. So, all right, so that's all I have for you Leo, till next time then, love and light, take care, namaste.